Good morning and welcome to today's daily vlog. I had to go out quickly this morning uh, when mum wanted some milk and some other little bits so I also got while I was out um, Tropical Punch Prime so we'll be trying that later and I also got the Lemon and Lime Prime as well so as you know we tried the um, Blue Raspberry um, was it a couple of weeks ago, a couple of months ago, we tried the blue raspberry one and um, I've now got the lemon and lime and the um, is it tropical punch, tropical punch flavours and lemon and lime. Um, I don't know whether to do one today and then one tomorrow or um, both today. And I get on with what I need to do online and have a little think. I might just do one today and then one tomorrow to um, space it out a bit. Um, but yeah, I'll have a think. But anyway, I need to get started with a few things online. So it's now 47 minutes past one. I'm about to go down for a break. Uh, but I've decided that what I'm going to do... So I'm going to try this one today and then like I said I'll try the other one tomorrow so we're going to try and review the lemon and lime prime today and then tomorrow I think this is like the big one I think this is the one that most people sort of like go for I think this is the, like the one like their original sort of go to one the have on all the um, branding and everything in the shops, all the posters and everything. I think this is the one that that um, has it. I think in the new white bottle, but I don't know what the new white bottle flavour is. So we're going to try that one tomorrow. I'm going to save the tropical punch for tomorrow, and we're going to have the um, the lemon and lime today. So um, yeah, I'm going to head down and have a break and then I'll be back to do the review okay so I'm now back from a break and I've got the lemon and lime prime just here um, let me read this a little bit to you prime was developed to fill the void where great taste meets functional function with bold first quenching flavours to help you refresh replenish and refuel prime is the perfect boost for every endeavour we're confident you'll love it as much as we do humble humbly the prime team so we've got 10.5% coconut water um, and then there's a list of um, other things like antioxidants B vitamins um, and other things um, you then got vitamins vitamin A, vitamin E, vitamin B6 and vitamin B12 um, you've got all the information just on here, they're going to focus. Don't know if they're going to focus on it. Don't know if you can see that very well. Um, so, yeah, you got all the um, things there. And um, that with that, um, it says to consume as part of a varied. And balanced diet and a healthy lifestyle. Vitamin E contributes to the protection of cells from oxidant 
oxidative stress, vitamin B6 and B12 contribute to normal energy yield, metabolism, and then you've got other little bits just there. But yeah, like I said, we tried the um, blue raspberry a couple of months ago, and we're going to try um, this prime lemon lemon lime now, and then tomorrow we'll do the tropical punch. So yeah, let's try prime lemon and lime. So um yeah, let's give it a try. Crack it open. Let's give the smell test first. Wow, you can definitely get that lemon, lime, citrus smell from it. That's quite potent really, that smell, the lemon, lime. You can't smell the coconut from the coconut water. The lemon and lime overpowers um, that because you've got quite a bit of coconut water in there. I think the base, is, the main base of the drink is coconut water with all the flavours. And um, yeah, it's um, it smells good. But you do get that lemon lime um, smell, right? straight through but anyway let's give it a try mm, it's very citrusy um, definitely get the lime right through that's good that's really good can't remember what I scored the blue raspberry but I think this is going to get quite a good score but yeah that smell it's really nice lemon lime smell it's very sharp as well with that smell not a taste But yeah, that's good. That's really good. Yeah, I do like that. Um, and like I've said before, I'm not a big fan of the energy drinks, and I don't think I'll get the energy drinks again. But these um, hydration drinks, I'm definitely going to be buying these again. They're really good. Um, so the score of the lemon and lime, lemon lime um, prime, I think I'm going to give it, I can't give it less than a 10, I just have to give it a 10, um, so yeah, 10 for the lemon lime prime, um, that was good, it's really good, um, so yeah, big thumbs up to KSI and Logan Paul for creating it um, as you don't know KSI and Logan Paul are um, YouTubers KSI being here in the UK and Logan Paul being American um, joined together I think I mentioned in the last video when I tried the um, Blue Raspberry they um, decided off with a boxing match and um, and everything and and they made friends afterwards and created this um this brand this brand of drink i think at one point ksi was almost going to pull out of it on the day he was supposed to launch and then um, logan paul talked him round, and they actually started the whole um company and the brand and everything so yeah really two big thumbs up to ksi and logan paul with this brand um I wish they would focus more on these hydration drinks over the energy drinks and built out more flavours in this and brought built up the hydration drink and not so much with the energy drink. I think the energy drink, I think 
We're trying to get it banned because the um, the amount of caffeine in it. Um, but yeah. Anyway, uh, so lemon and lime prime with you done, and I've given it a ten. But yeah. Anyway, um, I've still got a few things to do online, so I'm gonna get on with that. And then um, I think it's pizza for dinner tonight. So um, yeah. Anyway, I better continue on with what I need to do online. So it's a little bit earlier than normal. It's 54 minutes past four. But I'm going to get my computer turned off and um, start getting ready to head down for today. Um, Shut down. Is my computer going to turn off first time? No. Um, so I'm going to go back in. I'm gonna have to do um, a restart again, just because I was. I don't know why it does it. I could keep saying um, if I do a restart and then go to shut down again, it always shuts down from there. But um, yeah, sometimes it um, doesn't shut down when I tell it to. You know, obviously, you need to shut down. You can't just turn off a computer because otherwise you'll lose all your files and. All sorts of things will start happening. So um, you need to shut down properly every time, as you probably are aware. Um, but yeah, I'm going to do this restart and then head down, um, start doing dinner. We're having pizza tonight, so that'll be a nice, easy tea with the washing up and everything. So um, yeah, I'm let my computer restart. I'll get it shut down, and then we'll start heading down to do dinner. So I just got down to do dinner. My mum was going to have um, the blue raspberry prime. I've got it just here, because I've already tried it. My mum said that she wanted to try some. So um, I got her a bottle of the um, blue raspberry and she thought it was a bit too sweet. So um, she didn't want it, she wanted her evening whiskey instead. So she's had that and then I'm going to be having the um the prime she was gonna have and it's just here with ice. But I think it's very nice. It is very nice. I suppose it is a bit sweet. For some people they're probably a bit too sweet. Though. But anyway, I've got pizza for tonight. So I'm gonna get um pizzas in the oven get them cooked, get them eaten, then I'll be back after I've eaten. Oh, those pizzas were good. I didn't show you what we had, but we had a different one today because we had one um, substituted. It was this one. This is um, a stone bake. It's chicken with with a herb dressing. So let me see that just there. But um, yeah, we've never had that one before. That's got substituted. And it was kind of weird. It doesn't have like um, it doesn't have like a tomato base. It has like this, just like a herb base with like this chicken on it. I don't really know what I think to it. It's all right, and I quite liked it. But I do actually prefer a pizza with a proper um, tomato base to it. But um, anyway, I'd say Molly in the garden quickly. I think because. We haven't been out for a while yet. I need to remember to put the bin out as well. I thought it was raining then, but it's not. Anyway, Molly is down here. Go in, up on the line you go. Go, go. She's just there. I'll get the washing up done in a minute. It's gone quite cool out here now. It's actually quite nice. But, um,. Yeah, I think I'm going to let Molly do her business out here for a bit. And then um, we'll head in, get the washing up done. And then I might wa re watch last night, or what would have been last night's episode of EastEnders. It was on iPlayer, so I watched it. I might re watch that. 
and then watch what should have been like tonight's episode. Because um, it's like a double one tonight. But obviously last night it was online player, so I did watch the first part. But I'll probably re-watch it. Just to, um, just because I quite liked it. But yeah, anyway, I'm going to head in and start doing the washing up. So the washing up is now all done. It's now 42 minutes past 8. I can't remember what time I was ending the vlog um, last night. But anyway, I can't remember. Um, I'm going to watch EastEnders in a minute. Molly is through here. Just going to see what she's up to. She's down here on the floor. Just down here. She's been a little goody tonight, really. I've started moving that cushion. Remember that cushion um, she used to chew, which was on that chair over there. As you can see, it's not there anymore. I keep it down here now. Because obviously, as you can see, where she's bit, bitten all there. Um, I don't want to do that anymore. I don't want to like close this door and I'm doing the washing up and then take all this area away from her. But then she's got nowhere comfy to sit. So if I move the cushion while I'm doing the washing up, she's then still got free reign of that room and somewhere comfy to go and sit if she wants to. So um, yeah, I've started moving the cushion so she doesn't keep biting it and I've tried telling her not to, but um, yeah, that doesn't seem to do the trick. She doesn't touch it when I'm in the room. But it's when I'm doing the washing up out here and I can't see her. It's when she um, goes and bites and chews up that cushion. So I've moved it out of the way. She doesn't really, she can, I think she could if she wanted to try and get it off that um, ledge. But, um, but yeah, she doesn't really bother. And it's going all hot again today as well. Anyway. Um, yeah, now 44 minutes past 8, Is my computer on, yeah, my computer's all booting up and everything, get ready to do the editing a little bit later on, so I'm going to watch EastEnders, probably yeah, I'm going to watch both episodes again, I think, um, just to catch up on what I watched last night, and then the episode that would have been like tonight's episode anyway, and it's, um, the last episode of EastEnders for this week, it's Friday tomorrow, so um, so yeah, anyway, I'm gonna get a drink and uh, maybe a packet of crisps or something, and then go and watch EastEnders and then get on with the editing. So, I'm going to end today's vlog here. So, don't forget if you like the vlog, give it a thumbs up, subscribe, leave a comment, and click the bell so you always get notified when I upload new videos. And I'll see you tomorrow at 6 pm. So don't forget, if you dream it, believe it, achieve it. Good night.